What's up, guys? Bob Bob the Gamer here, coming at you with another Skyrim mod showcase. Today, we're going to be going over Enhanced Blood, specifically the Light Edition. Uh, if you're anything like me, you're not entirely happy with how the blood looks in Skyrim. And so, this mod aims to change that. It makes um, the blood screen, the bladders on your screen, a bit better, as well as the environment. It makes a lot more blood there. So I'm going to bring him over to this really well-lit area here and just kind of beat him up a little bit. And as you can see, there's, we're already getting some stuff on the floor here. I like getting it on the pillars because that gets quite um, decorative, let's call it. So as you can see, there's a lot on the pillars over here. Can't get a little spray on this box here. Now we're getting attacked by a bunch of dudes. It's okay. So as you can see, there is blood all over the place. Look at this pillar. As well as you can see, the blood splatters on my screen are changed. This guy is not going to be as good. Hang on, maybe I can be a little pro here. Nope. That's okay, we'll bring her over here. Finish him! So... Bloodlust triggered from a separate mod again, but that's okay. So you can really tell how much blood is all over the place here. Um, enhanced blood and textures. Oh yeah, look, there we go. It's on the pillar. Check this out. It's on the barrel. And it's just all over this pillar as well. As well as multiple spots on the ground. So it really does look like there was a giant, you know, like little skirmish here. Look at this rock. It's just covered in blood. Unfortunately, we didn't get any on that stoop, but yeah, that's um, that's the gist of it here. Check out this scene here. So here you can kind of see some of the blood textures. Not a ton. Um, I just wanted to spot that point. But down here, there is a trap right here. But you can kind of see it along the wall and the ground here and along the uh, dresser. Pardon the trap. Um, so you could really just tell the difference in the blood and how it really just outshines uh, the vanilla blood textures that were used. Yo, I thought this was a little cool scene. You can kind of see it's, it's definitely visible. It's definitely there. Here's with the torchlight. Um, it's very, very distinct. And then I want to show you guys down on it this way really quick. That's a body that I killed. So over here, kind of see the blood splatters on the floor from where they were experimenting on this poor force one guy and then you've got like the uh, the cowhide here which is full of blood too As you can kind of see here on the bed it definitely is altered and different I'm gonna go ahead and take a torchlight so you can kind of see it uh, and then what I, that's with night vision on uh, which you know normally I don't do um, but that's kind of what that looks like, and then I'm going to run over here really quick and show you guys they have a, a shrine here, which is very well lit, so I'm going to take the torch off. Um, you can see that it's like a beat up shrine and it's got like the skull on it and such, and then over here is a alchemy table, uh, which I thought looked really good. Here it is with the torch light. Uh, I really like this mod, guys. I've really tried to cut back on the amount of scripts that I have inside of my game to prevent, uh, you know, like script load and save loading and things like that. Um, and for me, this is this has got to be a must-have mod. It, it it looks fantastic. I'll continue to show you guys some different areas, but I really wanted to just kind of showcase this spot as I came across it. I thought it looked really good. So.
here, you can see there is a massive pile of blood, and I just love the way that this looks. So I've got Spells Emit Light on right now from my Vampire Lord, but you can just see it's just all over the place. There's so much blood. You can tell, especially on the Saber Cat, how beat up he's gotten. You can see sort of where the blood is and where the wounds were. I mean, this was a uh, saber cat that attacked, and you can see he's got several wounds up along his mouth, on his neck, the side here, on his paw, or shoulder, and then along the back. I just kind of wanted to show some of that off here. As you can see, it affects my screen. There's several things on the wall also. Attack him over here, and you can kind of see. Look at those blood splatters. So as you can see, I was involved in combat with someone, and just take a look at this. Her torch is very bright. Let me turn on light. But just take a look at it. All over the tanning rack. Like if you need a reason to download this mod, this is it right here. It also splattered some on the wall. There's also another spot over here I want to show you really quick. It's this way. So I was fighting this guy in here, and you could see some on the floor. But really, just it's scattered all over the bucket, all over the wall. Just. I'm telling you, if you are worried about the blood in Skyrim, this is absolutely the mod for you. Alright guys, that's going to be it for Enhanced Blood and Textures Light. If you enjoyed this video, please like and subscribe. Consider checking out one of these other videos somewhere around here, and I'll catch you in the next one. Peace.